Hello, everyone. This is Jim Okrasinski with your weekly lecture video. So I am looking at some of the posts on the discussion board and some interesting topics have emerged for the cultural artifacts essay. So uh, that being said, I want to just take a few minutes and talk about some of the content in Chapter 2, and we'll talk a little bit about uh, the task and the essay assignment. And I do want to point out a couple of uh, examples from my other classes that might help uh, some people along with the drafting of the uh, cultural artifacts essay. So needless to say, I want to get to the discussion on here in the textbook. Now, the textbook provides a really interesting uh, take on identity and culture. Um, if you've read through the sections, they're not terribly long. I have a few uh, important sections highlighted here in my copy of the textbook. Um, the idea of identity and exactly what culture is and the expressions, customs, practices, and experience that connect a person to other people in their past, present, future. Language is a big part of our cultural identity. Uh, the words we use, uh, the types of way we speak in our own voice is very central to that notion of identity. So uh, we have an idea here, here ugh, excuse me, have an idea here about uh, the culture includes observable, observable aspects, religion, language, or groups of peoples, intangible aspects such as shared preferences, attitudes, or behaviors. Okay, this is always the ubiquitous iceberg is used as the metaphor for culture. There's so much below a culture that you just do not see. But culture is not static. So I think it's important that we understand that culture does evolve as times and our people and our identity evolve also. So take some time looking at the cultural system in a lens. A cultural lens is important to how we view the world. And also, um, and part of our cultural lens is our voice. How is it that we wish to communicate our viewpoints? Okay, so it's important to understand as we get into the cultural artifacts uh, essay assignment. So let me scroll into the assignment here. Remember, your task is to choose an artifact that symbolizes something about a culture to which you belong. So that's some interesting posts. A lot of it is cultural, what it's meaning ethnic. Or a community, like the community, the discourse community I mentioned in the course unit. I believe there's a post out there being a, a, a part of the YouTube community, which is undoubtedly uh, a very uh, important community in today's world, right? So we're looking for uh, an essay using narrative style to describe, inform, and explain the significance of the artifact. You want to organize the structure of the essay so that an audience can understand it in uh, a narrative form, right? And provide lived experiences to support the significance of your cultural artifacts. So let me emphasize here that the artifact is the focus and how it has shaped who you are and your identity. So one thing I do want to point out here is I have uploaded two... Sample, example essays, if you like, that were just written this semester. Um, this particular student wrote about music and identity as a part of her culture and the types of a part of, uh, yeah, part of the culture as part of the, his, uh, um, I, you know, identity and how uh, this particular student grew up and the um, connection that this music had to shape who they are. And also an interesting one for, for um, some of you is uh, the idea that skirts became a cultural identity and is born out of the uh, pandemic. So I urge you to give um, both a read. If you have any questions or issues about them and you want to talk about them, I'll probably cover these a little bit more in depth in another lecture video. Um, both of them are formatted according to MLA guidelines, which should provide you with a model on how to um, format your particular document for the assignment, right? That's important there, along with the other resources like um, the Purdue OWL, all right? So uh, this is the opening lecture video for discourse community, and that would be saying for a cultural artifact. Uh, there'll be more on this going into the drafting uh, process 
next week. All right. If you have any questions or issues, please send me an email.